18th meeting of the Baltimore County Planning Board. It is now called to order. I'm Nancy Hafford, the chair of the board. We'll now start our meeting with a roll call to account for all of our members that are present this evening. Mr. Array. Aye. Ms. Brophy. Aye. Ms. German. Aye. Mr. Hafer. Aye. Mr. Heckman. Aye. Mr. Heinel. Aye. Mr. Hinton. Mr. Hinton. Mr. Halipka. Aye. Mr. Johnson. Aye. Mr. McGinnis. Aye. Mr. Perlow. Aye. Ms. Pinero. Aye. Mr. Warren. Aye. Ms. Wolfson. Aye. And Ms. Wolfson, I do love you. I was on mute. I couldn't talk. So. <laughs> I love you too, Todd. <laughs> Let's stop this love fest for the Pledge of Allegiance. <laughs> I think we lost you again, Nancy. Say the pledge. I pledge allegiance Flag. To, of the United States of America and to the Republic for which we stand, one nation under God, indivisible with liberty and justice for all. Ms. Bensley, is there any um, changes to the tentative agenda as published? No changes, Madam Chair. Thank you. In the May 9th email, you received draft minutes of the April 18th meeting. Has everyone had an opportunity to review the draft minutes? Yes. Are there any corrections? Not hearing any, may I entertain a motion to accept the minutes as published. Motion. Second. Second. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Okay. okay, before we start the next part of our meeting, I just want to thank you all, um, the planning staff, the planning board members for everything and all the time that you dedicated to go through the CZMP. It was, we listened to a lot of citizens from all over Baltimore County. We're all appointed by representatives in the areas that we represent because of how we care about our community. And we don't do this because it's a high paying job. We do it because we love the people we serve and what we do. So I wanna thank you all for reading through all the testimony that was sent to us and trying to discern information that could have been true or maybe not so true and making the best decisions we possibly can. And as we know, um, we're not the final decision makers in this. We give our recommendations, and if you have any feelings on any of the issues that we've received extra testimony on, I would highly recommend you talk to the person that appointed you and you share what your feelings are. So sorry for that little speech there, but I thought that was important to share. First, our first item on the agenda is the vote on the final board recommendation for the comprehensive zoning map process 2024 issues. The board involvement with the CZMP began in February with a public hearing in each of our councilmatic districts. In April, we held four work sessions in which we discussed, we deliberated, and we made recommendations. Our Deliberations were healthy, and the tasks making the recommendations to our county council on the CCMP 2024 issues were not completely home. I think your microphone's still having issues. You're like going in and out. Yeah, we can't hear you. You're completely out now, Nancy. Yeah. All righty then. Uh, now we can hear you. Okay. All right. Let's try this again. <laughs> Our CZMP issues were not taken lightly throughout this process. We received over 200 pieces of written testimony. 
Board members, before we vote, is there any comments you want to make? Um, I, I just want to note for the record that Mr. Hinton has joined us. Oh, thank you so much. If there are no further questions or comments, we will now vote on the totality of the issues confirming our recommendations as shown in log issues dated May 7th, 2024. This vote will constitute our final recommendations to the, uh, to the uh, county council. May I have a motion? Be it moved that the planning board log of issues dated May 7th, 2024, reflecting the 2024 CZMP subcommittee work be approved to constitute final recommendations by the planning board to the county council regarding the comprehensive zoning map process issues for 2024. May I have a second? Second. 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 Now we will do a roll call. Mr. Array. Aye. Ms. Brophy. Yes. Ms. German. Yes. Mr. Hafer. Aye. Mr. Heckman. Aye. Mr. Heinel. Aye. Mr. Hinton. Aye. Mr. Halipka. Aye. Mr. Johnson. Aye. Mr. McGinnis. Aye. Mr. Perlow. Aye. Ms. Pinero. Aye. Mr. Warren. Aye. Ms. Wolfson. Aye. Thank you all. Motion carries. These recommendations will be transmitted to the county council for further re review and consideration. The council will hold a public hearing in the respective council districts in June and will vote on their final CZMP 2024 decision on August 27th, 2024. Additional information will be available on the CZMP hub and council website. Thank you all again. Ms. Bensley will now fill us in on major actions of the May 9th Landmark Preservation Committee meeting. Thank you, Madam Chair. At their May 9th, 2024 meeting, the Landmarks Preservation Commission voted to issue five certificates of appropriateness to the following properties. The Rogers property located at 501 Bond Avenue in Reisterstown, the Klein property located at 308 Central Avenue in Glendon, the Wales property located at 31 Dunkirk Road in Rogers Forge, the Galmont property located at 9 Wall Avenue in Glendon, and the West property located at 1 Bart's Court in Lutherville, and that concludes the report. Thank you, Ms. Bensley. Ms. Bensley, can you now fill us in on legislation passed by the County Council following our last meeting? Thank you, Madam Chair. Bill 14-24 zoning regulations uses permitted CB zone fraternal organizations for the purpose of clarifying the community building use by right in the community business zone includes fraternal organizations and generally relating to uses permitted in the CB zone. Bill 17-24 2024 basic services maps for the purpose of repealing the basic services sewerage map, the basic services water supply map, and the basic services transportation map, and adopting a new basic services sewerage map, a new basic services water supply map, and a new basic services transportation map. Resolution 2224, adoption of the adopt the Reisterstown Main Street design recommendations. A resolution of the Baltimore County Council to adopt the Reisterstown Main Street design recommendations. Reisterstown is a five-block five retail district in western Baltimore County that is recognized by the Main Street Maryland program as a historic Main Street. In partnership with the Reisterstown Improvement Association, the Neighborhood Design Center and, and, and Access prepared an approach to addressing key challenges and opportunities for a thriving multimodal Main Street. Through this partnership, Reisterstown Main Street developed a streetscape plan, storefront design guidelines, and retail plan in order to define and enhance a community identity and improve its user experience for local residents and bolster its popularity as a regional destination. The vision of the design guidelines is to transform Main Street into a safe, inviting, and vibrant place for people to walk, bike, gather, and socialize, 
and businesses that can thrive in unison with the area's pedestrian priorities and safety goals, a vision that sets a new path forward and builds on the area's strengths as a walkable community and uplifts its historical small town character. And finally, Resolution 2424 adopts construction and materials standards and specifications manuals, a resolution of the Baltimore County Council to adopt the Baltimore County Department of Public Works and Transportation standard specifications for constructions and materials manual and the standard details for construction manual as approved by the planning board on May 7th, 2024. And that concludes the report. Thank you so much, Ms. Bensley. I must say this is the shortest meeting we've had in months. <laughs> and that's the conclusion of our agenda. Do, Do I, I have a motion? Second. I just I just want to wish Howard Aloha and wish I were with him. I'll bring them back for you all that aren't coming. I will see you tomorrow, Howard. I'll buy you coffee. Thanks. I don't drink coffee. Buy a cola. Okay. Nancy, I think you cut out again. Oh, oh okay. there you are. I said, thank you, gentlemen. We're going to stop this love fest and we're going to conclude the meeting. Thank you all again. Enjoy this one beautiful day because I'm sure it's going to rain for another 10 days. <laughs> it's going to be beautiful out here. Okay. Thank you.